Although uh, we've been embracing it for a little longer than I like to. <laughs> well, we had to listen to the groundhog. That's you know. right. We knew it was coming. It's gospel coming <laughs> from the rodent and six weeks of winter is still with us and it is much more winter like in spots here than others and places like Howell 31 degrees sub freezing. Decent amount of snow has come down and is still coming down, so able to stick a little bit better. While 35 in our metro zone, we've had rain and snow come through. I did get about an inch and a half of wet snow off of the uh, roof of my car today, but as I drove in closer to downtown, really not impacted, just damp and wet. But notice areas of Livingston and Oakland counties, also parts of northern Washtenaw. We see these darker blues moving into northwestern Wayne County here, and it's all pivoting essentially from west to east. And we have more wet weather to the north and to the west that still needs to move in. So Livingston, Oakland counties may get another two two to four inches in some spots, not covering or blanketing the whole area. Winter storm warning until 9 a.m. And then Livingston, Oakland will likely fill in the rest of the winter weather advisories. Does not include Wayne, Monroe, or Lenaway counties for tricky travel and a couple of inches uh, of snow still a possibility through the morning. Scattered snow this afternoon, maybe a couple of drips and drops with middle 30s, guys, but it gets breezy. It's starts to get a little bit colder and we have more Thursday snow. Stay tuned. I'll look at today's snow totals and as we head into tomorrow. Oh boy. All right, Brandon. this really is an all or nothing snow. A lot of areas uh, have little to no snow and then and then you take a look at Heartland, <laughs> but you can see in downtown Detroit. It's nothing out there across the city, but that is certainly not the case to our friends to our north, like in Livingston County, which already has more than a half foot of snow on the ground and it's still adding up. Mm. Nick Monticelli is there live. He's been clearing off the mailboxes. We should have sent you out there with the shovel. I'm sure the <laughs> residents would have appreciated that. <laughs> I'm sure they would have loved it, but nobody came up with a with a, with hot chocolate. So it's it's all or nothing thing for me too. You want your driveway plowed? You got to bring something out here. All right. So we're walking around here. This is the part of winter that I love. I mean, it's gorgeous to look at, gorgeous to be a part of, as long as it all doesn't fall down on me. So I'm going to move away from that tree. You talked about close to half a foot of snow, and in some areas, you see, you see me trying to get through some of this. There is that much snow out here. However, and here's the good news. This is M59. It's okay. I know it kind of looks kind of weird as I try to trudge through that snow out here, but posted speeds, the uh, road commission crews from Livingston, Oakland counties doing a fantastic job plowing these roads, keeping them salted. So everything is moving pretty good out here, although the snow is still coming down at a pretty good clip. So there are some tracks starting to form on these roads. The best advice I can have is that if you've got any kind of plans this morning to get out, especially in these areas, Livingston, Oakland County, give yourselves a little bit of extra time, especially if you're going to be going out of the uh, try to get out of these neighborhoods, because again, these areas not so good, although the bus came through here just a second ago, so now you can't even tell there was any snow here on the road. We're live here in Heartland, Nick Monticelli, Local 4 News today. All righty. <laughs> well, at least M59 looks good. Yeah, and Nick runs a mean bargain, though. He, he Tell him where you are so that people can come there and bring him. something. He's in Heartland at M59. Right there, so <laughs> hot chocolate, maybe a breakfast sandwich or two. Oh, that sounds good. You know? Thank you, Nick. <laughs>